Okay, so obviously I am a pretty big Back to the Future fan. When I saw on Amazon that they were releasing a 4K limited edition set, I just jumped on it. It was actually a pre-order, so after what feels like forever, uh, it finally arrived today. I actually did a video in 2005, so 15 years ago, uh, in my first car, it was called a Nissan Nissan Pulsar NX. Uh, and I still have the clip, so we're gonna watch it real quick. We go uh, into the future, into the past. Uh, we got some equipment here that helps us do that. We got our plutonium. We got our uh, flux capacitor. I fixed it today. <laughs> Yeah, super embarrassing, uh, except I had way more hair, which was really nice. Mm. Also, just to note, um, it's a Amazon exclusive, so specifically the 4K Blu-ray. It also has the normal Blu-ray, but it's the 4K Blu-ray set with the hoverboard. I've got it here, and I ripped it open to take a look at it, and... <laughs> so, I'm not like a hardcore, has to be absolutely perfect, like, collector or anything like that. But in typical Amazon fashion, uh, it's just like, that's not cool. Like every single corner has been smushed. So this box is like slowly turning into a ball. This is not conducive of protecting corners. So Amazon actually has a decent return and refund policy. So let's just see if I can maybe order a new one. Apparently unavailable probably means it's never gonna come back. So this is what I'm stuck with. Fortunately, I uh, chatted with someone on Amazon and I was able to get a bit of a discount on this. So even though it's smushy, uh, it was also cheaper now. Like, look at that. If you can see the craters on the moon from Earth, you can see that. Like, with that damage out of the way, let's open it up. So um, I'm gonna go get the chainsaw. Turns out, uh, to be airport friendly, I have a, a knife that has no knife, so it's just, Okay, so I've got this other little guy here. I don't even know like why I'm being careful. I might as well just like... What well, my biggest fear at this point is uh, what everything looks like in, on the inside. Like it's so shiny and new and then someone was like... <laughs> you open it up and it's got like this two little compartments, right? You have your actual Blu-ray set here and then this is the hoverboard here. So that's kind of cool. Like a tiny, tiny, tiny little bit, but it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's all fine. Everything's fine. It's all fine. It's fine. Let's do the hoverboard first. Here's the actual base. It has really nice acrylic sides on it there. That's kind of cool. Fingerprints, which I don't even think are mine. I'm gonna have to get a forensic team down here. Back to the Future, 35th Anniversary Limited Edition. It's this little base. Obviously this is uh, made of metal, and then you take these magnets which are flipped to the negative side, so it, instead of attaching to the metal, it repels it. It comes with this little plastic hoverboard. And the bottom it's just got magnets. So it's nothing like, it's nothing like super crazy, but it's still kind of cool. And then I think all you do is you take the hoverboard and you just, it's really simple, but that, come on, come on. It's so simple, but it's so cool. Look at it, look at it. Oh. I don't know why I try and sell like Batman when I do that. Let's dig in, let's dig in, shall we? Oh my goodness, I'm so nervous. I'm gonna like, I'm gonna mess this thing up. People who know how to do this, they're like, ah, what is he doing? Uh. There it is. Four times sharper than full HD with HDR for brighter, deeper, more lifelike color. The front, mmm, delicious. Back to the Future, the ultimate trilogy. Whoa, what? Okay, I didn't notice this. That's weird. So on the actual box, it says, Back to the Future, 35th anniversary trilogy and on the inside box it just says back to the future the ultimate trilogy so let's slide this and so oh oh so it's got this book 
There's Marty on the front, part of the DeLorean, then a sweet shot of the DeLorean on the back. That looks pretty cool. And then this is the first page there. It's pretty cool. On your first page here, you have your 4K Blu-ray. Whoa, of Back to the Future, sideways. And then there's the Blu-ray version, 4K of Back to the Future 2, and then your Blu-ray version, 4K of Back to the Future 3, and your Blu-ray version. And then this last disc is like a bonus features disc. So that's what all the pages look like. This is nice. This is a nice little book. Uh, and it just slides in here. I think what I'll do is I'll keep this on the shelf. Uh, and this I'm going to just put away somewhere because it looks like mashed potatoes. This is the part I want. I'm not going to throw this out, but that's... So that's a quick look at the Back to the Future limited edition 35th anniversary trilogy, ultimate trilogy, whatever you want to call it. I like it. I think it's cool. And when I watch it on my 4K Blu-ray player that I don't have yet, but it's coming in mid-November. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next episode.